<laughs> All right, you guys ready? That's it. Welcome you to our annual Creeby here at Wapunuk. I want to wish you guys all good luck, and I want to thank our audience for being active listeners this morning. Dancing means hi. Dancing means hi, yes it does. So today you will get certificates and pencils. For your assembly in April, we will have prizes then awarded for our first and second place winners. So mid-April sometime. So in case parents ask, you guys can let them know that. Now here's how the bee's gonna commence. You are gonna get two chances. If you get two incorrect words or you have to skip two words, then you will be eliminated from the competition. All right? If everybody gets the first word wrong, we'll start again with the second word. Does that make sense? We'll go along like that. All right, let's get started. Who's our first person? Jaylene Kirkness. All right, Jaylene, this word is for you. Tanse etuyan, the word go. How do you say go in Cree? Would you like to try the next person? Yeah? All right, come on up, my dear. Ask them to the microphone. Tanse etuyan, go in Cree. How do you say go in Cree? Let's try the next person. You ready? What's the next person's name? Connor McLeod. You can call him up, eh? Okay. Connor, how do you say go in Cree? Dan si tu en go. No, you don't remember that one? Okay, have a seat. Uh -huh. Una That's okay. Landon Spence. Landon, dan si tu en go in Cree. Don't know what I think. Okay. Jackson Greaves. Jackson Greaves, come right here. Okay. All right, Jackson, Tan Si Tuyen, go in Cree. How do you say go? Huh? Okay. okay. Next, Naomi Coxon. Come on up, Naomi. All right, Naomi, how do you say go in Cree? Dan si tu yan go. No? Okay, sit down. Okay, we can commence two ways. We can either go on with the second word and continue in English and ask them to translate in Cree, or if you guys think we can go from Cree and have them translate to English, what do you think? Try, try one more round and we'll go from there. Okay. All right, ask them. Jaylene Perkness. All right, Jaylene, up to the microphone. All right, Dan Si Tuyen, the word one, the number one. How do you say one in Cree? Like when you're counting. No? All right. John James Kirkness. Ask them John James. Do you remember how to say one in Cree? Okay, how do you say it? Give it a try. How do you say the number one? No? Okay. Connor. Connor McLeod. Do you remember how to say the word one in Cree? Yeah. The number one. Number one? Yeah, how do you say number one in Cree? I know, number one. You don't remember, okay? I know. Maybe we'll switch it around. Landon Spence. Landon. All right, Landon. Landon Spence. Landon Spence. Landon. All right, Landon. Do you remember how to say the number one in Cree? Um. Mm. 
No? Okay. Let's try the last two and we'll go the other way. Jackson Reeves. Come on, Miss Jackson. Yeah, come up. Dan Situyen, the number one in Cree. No? Okay. Naomi Coxon. All right, Naomi. Do you remember how to say the word one in Cree? The number one. You've got a silent bunch, you guys. <laughs> no? We'll, we'll switch it up. We'll go from Cree and have them translate to English. All right, let's try the next round. <laughs> We're all striked out. Well, let's start again from the beginning. And we're gonna have, yeah, we're just gonna start again. All right, okay. first one up. Jaylene Perkness. Jaylene Aspen. Okay, Jaylene, I'm gonna ask you the word in Cree. Tell me if you can say it in English, what it means. Do you know what the word ape means? If I say ape, what am I saying? Oh, oh, shh, don't, don't, don't say it out loud. Ja Next person. John James. What does the word ape mean in Cree? Stand up. Hmm? Stand up. Mots. Or oh, that's you guys. Okay. Now we start with the X's. Yeah. All right, Connor, you're next. What how do you what does the word ape mean in Cree? Oh. Hmm? Oh. He doesn't know it. Oh, okay. No? Okay. Sit down. Who's our next? Landon Spence. You ready, Landon? Yep. What does the word ape mean? Sit. Jackson Reeves. What does the word kisigak mean? Kisigak. Hmm? Oh, no. Say it louder. Boy. Huh? One more time. Boy. 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 Thank you, Jackson. Sit down, please. Thank you. Oh, now go. Naomi Coxon. All right, Naomi. What does the word dipiskak mean? Dipiskak. Louder. Boy. Huh? Boy. Warm night though. Boy. 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 One more time. Boy. I think that's what she said, boy. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so let me continue on. Okay. We are back up to the front. Jaylene? Yeah. Jaylene. Jaylene. Jaylene, sorry. What does the word pussies mean in Cree? Pussies. Yeah. 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 Okay, John James, you're up. What does the word nisto mean? Nisto. No? Okay, is that two strikes? Nisa? Okay. Oh, I thought we were at John James too. Yeah? Mm -hmm. All right, John James, you can go have a seat with your class. Thank you. Yes. Okay, Connor. Connor, you're up. He's upset. Come on. Do you want to go next then? Do you want to go? Okay. Come on up then. Well, what's who's that? What London, right? Mm -hmm. What's London? Okay. What does the word mitatat mean? Mitatat. Ah, uh, Sainis, right? 
All right, you can go join your class and sit down, please. Uh huh. Mots? Always got that one. Okay. Okay, hold on. Stay, Landon. Okay, next person. Jackson Briggs. All right, Miss Jackson, come on up. What does the word mahigan mean? Mahigan. Mahigan. What does mahigan mean in English? What word is that? Mahigan. Mahigan. Motspa. How many is that? Four. Okay, you can go join your class, Jackson. Go sit with your class. Connor, we used to sit with his class, see ya? Yeah, he didn't. He didn't. Okay, Connor, you can go sit with your class. All right, who's our next one up? Uh, Naomi. Naomi. What does the word tepagoop mean? Tepagoop. <laughs> tepagoop. No? Okay, what do we have for, for her? Four. All right, you can go sit with your class now. Thank you, honey. All right, you two ready? This is for our first and second place now. All right. What does the word atim mean? What, what's an atim? find one of them. Yeah. All right, your turn, my dear. Uh, one of the two. Yes. What does the word atim mean? Sit. Atim? Come here. Go. Okay, so I guess we'll do one more word and see who gets it. Okay. Somebody has to get it. Yeah. All right, have a seat, my dear. All right, you're back up, my dear. Ask them. What does nipawe mean? Nipawe. Okay. All right, let's try. Landon, you're up again. Landon, what does the word nipawe mean? Nipawe. What does that mean in English? Come to the microphone and talk. Sit. Sit. Okay, we'll go another round or two and see if we can get a word. Yeah. All right, Jaylene, you're up. Jaylen. What does the word astam mean? Astam. Come here. Say it louder. Say it louder. Come here. Hmm? Say it louder. You're good. Say it loud. You just have to say it louder. I thought I heard it. What does astam mean in Cree? If somebody says astam to you, what are they saying to you? You already said it. Say it again. Say it again. Say it loud. You, you had it, I think. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. 
What was your first answer for ask them? What does it mean? Come here. All right, there it is. Yay. Is that our first and second? Yeah, she's first and second. All right, so uh, we have her first. Is it J Jalen, J-A-L, J-A-I-L, Y-N. And then Kirkness. Okay. Uh, we will get the certificates out right away and then the prize will be. So find a pencil for her and a fun thing. And we'll do a second place certificate for him as well. Okay. How do you spell Landon? L A N D Y N? Okay, so it's like this. Yeah, they attach on here. The pencil attaches. Okay. I'll put up this one for the girl. No, this one for the girl. Yeah. The camera's at the diner. Thank you. How do these go on? <laughs> like they're like Crocs, look. Yeah. Oh yeah, like that. Like Crocs. <gasps> kind of neat, eh? Yeah, yes. All right. Snap it on. So good, okay. so good. Okay. Move this. <laughs> no, that's a big one. No, that's a big one. We're right here. I slid it on. <laughs> <laughs>